Hey guys, and welcome to today's NBA Play of the Day. If you're looking to get more pick content, including our free play as well as all of our top confidence bets across the NBA, college basketball, MLB, and NHL, you can head on over to our main website, stumpthespread.com, which I will link down in the video description. And also, if you want more of this pick video content in the future, you can click that subscribe button. Also, head on over to our channel to get today's daily uh, college basketball pick video as well as our daily MLB Play of the Day video as well. So heading into today's matchup, just one game in the NBA landscape, obviously, with the College Basketball National Championship. The NBA is trying to help out a little bit with not having uh, too much competition there with that game. So we have Portland versus Minnesota. Interesting matchup here between two young up-and-coming teams out west. The Portland Trailblazers, really glad that they were able to really get themselves together and make a surge more in the second half of the regular season, pushing for that last playoff spot. This group now standing 38-38 and overall, and they are 12-23. and excuse me, 16 and 23 on the road. Portland looking pretty solid in their uh, ability to make the postseason and could be a tricky matchup in the first round, even though Portland is a young up and coming team. They certainly have postseason experience. Um, and, you know, having a guy like Damian Lillard, as well as McCollum being one of the better backcourt tandems in all of uh, the NBA makes this group a threat in the first round, especially they have a really solid home court advantage and solid crowd support as well. So that's another thing to watch out for whoever uh, Portland ends up getting in that first round matchup. So Portland in their last outing blitzed past the over for us as they went on to beat the Suns by final of 130 to 117. And Portland's been hitting on the over quite a bit. This is a team that loves to push the pace of play. Even though they do sacrifice their defense quite often, ranking sixth in the NBA in scoring average, putting up 108.6 points per game, and also not ranking very well on the defensive side of the ball, ranking 26th in the NBA in points allowed, giving up 109.1 points per game. So they actually average uh, half a point less per game than what they're giving up. And for as solid as Portland's offense has shown um, more often than not this year, uh, definitely their defense is something to worry about. But this group loves playing fast, and when you play fast, you're just going to be giving up more points than your typical uh, squad. So Portland heading on the road today to play the Minnesota Timberwolves. Minnesota in their last outing was in a high-scoring affair as they went on to lose to the Sacramento Kings by final of 117 to 123. That one, the total hit 140 in that matchup. So both of these teams are coming off of very high-scoring results. Minnesota... They are slowly but surely heading in the right direction as a franchise as their young players continue to gain experience. Minnesota not probably having quite the year that they were hoping for, but still getting a lot of those young guys, a lot of playing time, standing 30 and 45 overall, and they are 19 and 20 on their home court. Minnesota is a little bit more balanced than the Trailblazers, ranking 14th in the NBA in scoring average and 18th in total defense. And they average... Uh, 0.7 points less per game uh, scoring than what they give up. So both of these teams aren't quite as good on the defense side of the ball as they are offensively, but uh, Portland certainly knows how to fill up uh, the stat sheet and put up a lot of points. And with both of these teams putting up quite large total numbers recently, and with this total currently sitting at 216, that means both teams are going to have to get um, right at about their season average and maybe slightly higher. And that seems like it has a great shot of happening considering both of these teams rank in the bottom half of the NBA in total defense. So as our NBA play of the day, we are going to go ahead and side with the over 216 and a half points. Uh, and you can see that that shifted up to about 217, 217 and a half. We still like the over to hit in that scenario as well. So guys, again, if you want more pick content, including our daily free play, head on over to our main website, stumpthespread.com, which I will throw a link to down in the video description. And also head on over to our channel to get today's uh, college basketball pick video, as well as our daily MLB play of the day video as well. And if you want more of this pick content in the future, you can click that subscribe button. So thanks guys for stopping on in again today, and we will see you in future videos. Bye.